Hey y'all, hey y'all. Welcome to my channel. This is Straight Facts Commentary where I give you my unpopular opinions in everything pop culture. So please, please, please stick around and subscribe for more. Hey y'all, I am back again with another video. And in today's video, you see the title, you see the title. We are going to be speaking about Sabrina Carpenter because apparently fans are upset at her for something else. So we're going to get into it. If you're interested in her, female rap, pop conspiracy theory, sharing topics, my popular opinions, whatever. I feel like getting into it for all. Go on ahead and subscribe and let's get into this video. Okay, so my baby, you know, my baby Sabrina, she's been in the, the news recently because she dropped her album. Her album's doing amazing. It's projected to do amazing. So there's all this drama. There's been talk with, you know, Camila Cabello, her, Shawn Mendes, like whole bunch of stuff olivia rodrigo's being thrown in there like it, my girl's just on fire the controversies are controversying right now for her which is great press it's great press for the album overall harmless nothing too crazy but fans are frustrated with her because of a lyric that they found in her newest song that they're not happy with okay and i kind of gagged actually <laughs> When I heard the lyric myself, because I was like, wait, girl, what? Because uh, I was like, wait, what? Uh, is this about Shawn Mendes? Because the other day in my comments from my last video, some of you guys were saying that isn't Shawn Mendes gay? And I'm just like, um, I don't believe he ever came out to confirm that. I mean, I don't want to speculate about somebody's sexuality unless they come out to say that they are that thing i personally try not to do things like that but a lot of you guys were like oh my gosh like um isn't he gay da, da, da. then this song comes out and it's a lyric where she's basically like if he doesn't like me or he doesn't mess with me then clearly he's gay and i'm just like oh okay so it says people are not happy with sabrina carpenter's lyrics on new bonus track busy woman and the lyric says, if you don't want me, I'll just deem you gay. Sabrina Carpenter on new bonus track, Busy Woman. Now, what I will say about this before anything, because fans had some things to say, which we'll get into in a second. Um, This was entirely very smart and very calculated. I think she knew exactly what she was doing with this being the bonus track because we dropped the album right there was a whole bunch of you know controversy and speculation on whether or not she was talking about camila and sean for majority of the album and that was a firestorm on social media and still kind of is and then you know that settles down a bit and now we get a surprise bonus track that is talking about somebody being gay and the internet apparently infamously calls Sean Mendez gay, even though he hasn't come out to, uh, you know, confirm it. And I think it's based on, like, his mannerisms and how he talks and different things like that. And so people were like, oh, is he gay? Da, 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 da. Right? So I'm like, this was, this was very smart. This was very strategic. This was very, like, purposeful because it's like, okay, it's getting the conversations back started again. It's causing conversation. People are, some people are mad. Some people are, don't think anything some people think it's funny and sabrina carpenter has had a track record though at this point to be very unserious like her like if you really want to like think about it too her entire album is unserious as hell like if you actually <laughs> listen to short and sweet from cover to cover which i just got my cd by the way i'm so mad because i'm not home and i wanted to open it on the video to show you guys my cd i probably will i probably still will do that um maybe once i get home in a different video but yeah if you listen to short and sweet you know from cover to cover there is so many funny off-putting like random hilarious silly lyrics like throughout the entire album it is so funny i'm sitting up here cracking up in the middle of a song that sounds deadpan serious as shit I think Sabrina has mastered the art of outrage at this point because I feel like Sabrina is going to say something or do something that's going to set the internet on fire and it was going to be one of her quirky jokes. Like, for example, the whole BBC thing. Remember the BBC radio thing <laughs> where she was singing? And at the end, she did the, you know, the punchline thing that she does for nonsense and she was talking about a BBC radio, but like BBC and she made a joke and the internet was like oh my god why would she say that like so i think it's a similar thing 
Um, but also I do see why some people are like, girl, what the heck? Not because it was a slur or anything, but because they're like, okay, why would you say that? Cause Sean Mendes hasn't come out as gay. Um, but I guess a lot of, a lot of women do that. I personally don't, but I guess a lot of women do that. They're like, oh, well, if he's not attracted to me, then he must be gay. (laughs) If he's not trying to get like, if he's not trying to get with me, he must like boys. I mean, I feel like in some cases it might be true. In some cases it isn't. I guess it just depends on the guy. But um, you guys let me know what you think about this. But let's go ahead and get into some comments. That rubs me the wrong way, to be honest. Okay, Sean and Joshua. Anybody else notice that these pop girlies are using the word gay in nearly all of their songs for clout? It's getting boring. Oh, that's not a weird thing to say. History repeats itself. So go on and tell your friends that I'm obsessive and crazy. That's fine. I'll tell mine that you're gay. Oh my gosh. Girls with huge egos can't fathom the fact that not everyone wants them. They always have the lamest comeback when rejected. Are you gay? I'm gay and I don't care. Thanks for reading. I'm gay. It's a joke. Also, it's not really an insult. It's just her being like, well, they're gay and that's why they're not interested. Not because there's anything wrong with me. Y'all joke about being Delulu and when an artist does it, you have a problem it's not that serious. It's not that deep. Bro, it's effing 2024. Stop calling someone gay as an insult or a comeback. Y'all be crying over everything at this point. OMG, stop. Why are we acting like she said a slur right now? Y'all wouldn't have survived the 2000s. Too sensitive. Why are you guys so sensitive? Hello, watch these tweets be made by straight people. I'm gay and it's funny AF. Of course she's not serious because that's not the kind of artist she is. She has fun uh she has fun writing songs and includes ad libs which make her songs so girly pop. You just have to get it to get it. They could never make me hate you, Miss Carpenter. Okay, so those are some comments. Um, you know, Twitter. Twitter is more mad than the rest of the world is. But um, what do you guys think? Do you guys think she was like using it as an insult? Or do you think she was using it as an explanation to why this guy isn't interested, but like in a kind of dig way? I don't know. You guys let me know. And that's it for this one. I will talk to you in the next one. Bye.